three volunteers who have been testing an at-home steam therapy device in hopes it would provide some relief for their allergy and sinus symptoms. The question is, did they find relief? Well, we have Tamir, Chris, and Beth Ann joining us now in the audience. So Tamir, let's start with you. How did you do? The product definitely helped with my dryness in my throat, so I don't, <coughs> you know, make yeah, that, that noise. Yeah, that post-nasal oh, drip. Like, uh, it annoys everyone around me, but I, I did, you know, notice that my throat did, you know, moisten up. Um, I didn't experience, you know, a lot of relief with the, you know, my drainage and everything, but I think if I use it a little bit longer, I definitely think it will help a little bit better with that. Okay. Chris, how about you? What did you think of the product? For the first couple of days, I really, um, I thought it was working, but then I had a major allergy attack in the middle of the week. Mm. So I don't know if it's necessarily the greatest product for everyone. And Beth Ann, how about you? Well, all I have to say, it's become my new best friend. Really? <laughs> I love it. And you know, it's interesting during this time of year, the weather's colder, the air mm -hmm. is drier. You know, a lot of people think allergies only occur during certain times in the spring and fall, but allergens, especially the ones that live in your home, can be year-round yeah. in combination with colds. And there are a lot of therapies out there that we've talked about time and time again, nasal saline, steam, and really, what you know, this is clearly yeah, part of it is I mean, moistening the air. Let's take a step air. back. Let's think about what, what the nose and sinuses are there for. Number one, it's there for filtration, to, to heat the air, to uh, purify the air, help the flow of air come in, and, and drain the sinuses that also serve a purpose to keep the head lighter uh, and, and uh, affect how we speak. So that being said, anything that's going to help the function, the physiology of the nose and passages is a positive thing. We know that steam, warm air, moist air, is going to help the nose with its job doing all those things. Now, allergies are a whole different thing. It's a reaction to a, to a, a foreign agent, a... Uh, the steam can be anybody. soothing. The, it well, that's soothing, it's, right. it's going to help with the symptoms. So you can't, if you're having a really bad flare-up like you did, that cleaning it out may not be enough to really get a handle. Yeah, I, I mean, allergies, I would go more the, the nasal saline route where, you know, you're functionally getting that those fluids in there, helping remove some of the allergens. But steam itself, you know, it's interesting. I grew up, and I always would get croup as a kid. Mm -hmm. That's and, when steam's great. That's what you Well, I just, I remember my mom constantly, you know, either putting my head sort of around some steam or getting in the mm -hmm. shower. And it always made me feel better. Well, I think we're all in agreement that this definitely does help. And you know, for somebody that has particularly bad issues that just dry nose, the nose isn't working and needs some help, then then maybe the cost of this, which is $150, which compared with some other treatments is a little high. Look, finding whatever modality works for you to reduce your symptoms is really what it comes down to. Um, and, and like you said though, the biggest thing is keeping those nasal passages moist. Yep. And, and yes. um, certainly, the, I will say this, if I may. This sounds, uh -oh. no, no. <laughs> so I actually, it's, it, I was surprised at how easy it was to do. Um, I installed at my home shower one of those things. It's a device that spits steam out into the shower while you're showering. Yeah, steam shower. It's amazing. Yeah, I have one too. It's the best thing ever. It's amazing. So it's shower just a battery. simple attachment that gives you. It creates. It's got a little box and it creates yeah. this, this and very you can subtle device. You add eucalyptus to it and it and oh, it really now you're opens you up. You talk. Oof, nice. Wow. But thank you all three so much for trying this out and. We hope you enjoy the rest of your winter season, hopefully symptom-free.